Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the four new Dove Silky Smooth Chocolate Bars. I have the Salted Caramel Blondie Chocolate, the Almond Brittle Milk Chocolate. Uh, bourbon Vanilla and Raspberry Rosé. Rose, you could do it. <laughs> <Rose. laughs> These were a dollar eighty-eight each at Walmart, but they have three servings in each container. And the reason I even knew to get them is because Cheryl uh, contacted me, I think through Facebook, and she told me she said I found the salted caramel blondie chocolate in the checkout at Walmart. Um, you should look for it. Well, I was able to find the bourbon vanilla and the raspberry rosé, but not the salted caramel and the almond brittle. So I was glad when I went back and found them. They had the box for the salted caramel, but they were like, they had like four boxes and they were all empty. Yes, they were <laughs> so like, loud. Like, like people saw that and went, I want those. <laughs> yeah, so for like a week solid, yeah. we were going back all the time That's and they funny. didn't have it. But they were not in the checkout at our Walmart. No, they were back for the candy bars and stuff. Yes, they're at the end of like the uh, candy aisle on an end cap in a special display. These all have the same calories. Mm -hmm. A third of the bar, 31 grams is 170 calories. Mm, that looks good. Looks oh, and I should tell you that the, each one of them has a um, description. Salted caramel blondie chocolate. A delicious blend of white and milk chocolate featuring sweet caramel notes and a hint of sea salt. A so. hint means it's probably not going to be in there. <laughs> we won't be able to taste any salt. Okay. Oh, I love the shape of them. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Kind of makes your eyes like twitch. <laughs> It's like one of those pictures that... Yeah, but it looks like they're, they're filled or something. I know, it does oh. look like that. So, how do you think... I don't think, think they're supposed to be like that. I don't that? think they're filled, though. Or you think you're supposed to only eat one of those? Oh, okay, so... <laughs> Not filled. Hmm. I got a hunk of salt. Got a couple pieces of salt. That's nice. It reminds me more of white chocolate than salted caramel. It does me too. It's a yes. It has that same texture, the same flavors almost as a white chocolate. Yes, I got the salt. Mm -hmm. There's little crunchy nice. bits of salt in there. Um, but the for the I, I do taste the caramel, but for mm -hmm. the most part, you really are tasting white it's chocolate. It's a white chocolate. It's got the same texture, same general mm -hmm. flavor as white chocolate. So it's an incredibly sweet with Very that saltiness, sweet. that white chocolate mm -hmm. saltiness, and that's really good. Yeah, I like it. it. It's it's a little caramely. I wish it was a little more caramel in it, but I'm not gonna complain too much because it's a really good candy bar. Yes, it's very good. This is the um, almond brittle milk chocolate, rich buttery toffee and roasted almond pieces wrapped in uh, silky smooth milk chocolate. So buttery toffee, almonds, milk chocolate. That. You want to show the bottom of that? Because it looks like you get plenty of coffee and almonds. There's the top. There's the bottom. Has that. Sorry. That's <laughs> the top. It's kind of wonky, wavy. And there's uh, there's little there's D's of... on each piece. It has oh, a yeah. little D Let's for dove. So that is intended to be your piece. It's this size. Hmm. I immediately got the almond. Oh yeah. Dove chocolate's a really good chocolate anyway. It's very smooth, very creamy, mm -hmm. very high quality chocolate. Um, who are they made by? Mars. Mars. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There was like plenty of, of toffee pieces in there. Mm -hmm. Plenty of toffee pieces, plenty of almond. The toffee pieces are crunchier. They're very sweet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, the, but you know, you don't taste the toffee that much. I mean, you get a little bit of it. It's more chocolate and almonds. Chocolate, yeah. And the milk chocolate is a very, very nice, good. smooth milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. but I like that a lot. I like the caramel better, but I like that one a lot too. Hey, right, this one's an odd combination for me. It's bourbon vanilla and dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. um, it says it is premium bourbon vanilla swirled through silky smooth dark chocolate. So yeah, the dark usually you don't, ooh, okay, this is that's well, trippy. Trippy looking. It is. It's pretty. It's yeah, very, very pretty. nice. Wait till you see this. This is a pretty candy bar. Wait, well, the picture on the front um, no, showed it. 
It smells good too. There's the front. See how it's all swirled together? Yeah, I like that. Does the front show it that way too? Yeah, but you really can't appreciate it until you see it until like that. See it. Yeah. Again, very smooth chocolate. I get the bourbon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that really strong vanilla. The, but then the, the dark kind of takes over towards the end. The dark chocolate, it, it has the crispiness, like the crispiness of a regular um, dark chocolate bar, like you would expect it to be a crisper chocolate. I don't know how I feel about that. I like it. See, I just get a very little vanilla kind of mm -hmm. at the beginning, mm -hmm. and then it goes away. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I like it. I, I would eat that. I would not buy that one again. Really? The, yeah, that's now, just see, not I would, for me. If you like, if you're remotely like, like dark chocolate, I, I like bourbon, but I don't. I don't know that I like that whole combination. Mm, I like I, that's just me. I like it. I would. I would get it. And it's, it's a not, very pretty candy. Bar. And it's not so dark where it's bitter either. No, it wasn't bitter. It's something you with don't the like that bourbon, bourbon vanilla. vanilla. Yeah, I don't know that I care yeah. for that. See, that dark, doesn't stand out flavor chocolate. for me anyway. So right. it's mostly a dark chocolate, but it's a sweet. Smooth dark chocolate, not a bitter, sharp dark chocolate. Right. Okay, this one is the Raspberry Rosé. It is um, in dark chocolate. It is a sweet pink layer with raspberry and rosé flavors over smooth silk dark chocolate. And I do like raspberry. I do like uh, raspberry and dark chocolate, you know, like you would get out of a selection box. Uh, mm -hmm. I like that combination. Little white raspberry creams? Yes. Yeah, see, I, I like never like those that much. <laughs> I like the orange cream and the raspberry cream. Ooh, it's pretty. It's like a dusty, dusty rose color. And that's dark chocolate on the bottom. These are, um, they're hard to break. Because they're kind of small like that, the right. small squares. Yeah, it is smaller than you would expect. They're kind of hard to grab. Wow, that is strong. <laughs> it has little seeds or something on through there too. I don't know if I like that or not. Now, see, you probably love it. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. But it's out of the four, it's not one that I would pick up. I'm going to try another one of the bourbon. I try another one too, just to see. Hmm. That raspberry is a very strong berry flavor. Mm -hmm. it, it really doesn't stand out as raspberry necessarily to me, it's just berry. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, it probably is that raspberry flavor. But that one's, not, I think it's good. But I'm not a huge lover of raspberry, so I probably wouldn't. I do like raspberry, but I still wouldn't choose it. It um, it's kind of gummy bear kind of raspberry <laughs> to me. I like gummy gummy uh, raspberry. It, it's raspberry, but it verges on a floral to yeah, me. Yeah, I agree. There's I agree. something floral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I agree. 100. I agree. Yeah, oh, it's probably that rosé, which is rose. Yeah, it's it. <laughs> I, I don't care for the floral part of but it. It's the rosé, is what you don't yeah. like, and it's same <laughs> for me. Both of those, honestly, the dark chocolates, I would leave. It, I would. It is like you're eating a flower. Yeah, it really is. There's something about it. That's that, my least favorite. Yeah. I don't mind it, but if you like that flavor, you, you'd probably pick it. But, yeah, they're hard to break. Uh-huh, they are hard to break. They burn calories and break them. Mm -hmm. um, so the raspberry is my least favorite. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I think, uh, what was the second one? Like the toffee? The almond brittle with toffee and... Hmm. I'm going to say salted caramel. No, I'm going to say the almond brittle is my number one. Mm -hmm. And then I actually like this dark chocolate number two, and then the caramel three, and then the rose, the raspberry rose third, fourth. Completely different from you, I'm sure. Well, you're probably going to go right down the road. Right? No. No, I'm going to say almond brittle is my favorite too. Yeah, it's very good. I like the it. The almond brittle, I love the toffee pieces. I love the flavor of the toffee and the, the almond and the milk chocolate. It's so good. Mm -hmm. But my second one is going to be the salted yeah, caramel. And I think I like the dark chocolate one just a, just the uh, And the dark chocolate, the I just one. wouldn't get either one of them again. Yeah. Even though I do like dark chocolate, so it's not like I don't like it or at all. I, I normally do like dark chocolate. I just don't care for those. Yeah. yeah. But if you... Um, 
are interested in any of these at all, you should get them. Oh yeah, um, definitely good quality chocolate. Even the one we didn't like necessarily the flavor of, it's still really good. Yeah, chocolate. still good quality chocolate. And a dollar eighty-eight, it's not bad, not bad when you think that you can divide it out into three uh, servings, and they're small. I mean, those, these bars break into pieces that big, and so if you do that three times, you're going to get a lot of individual mm -hmm. little bars of chocolate. It, it, they'll last you a little while. Um, so I hope this was helpful to you. Uh, Cheryl, thank you again for letting me know that these were out there to look for them. Um, I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.